The customer chat plugin is another tool you can use to grow your bot audience. It's going to be particularly valuable if you already have a website, which is where you embed the customer chat plugin that's driving a lot of traffic. But even if you have a new website or it's not garnering that much traffic, I would still highly encourage you to try out the customer chat plugin because it's super engaging. You can even embed different versions of the chat bot or specific entry points on different pages of the website. So this is an example of it in the lower right hand corner here on Leeds Beckett University's website, but they could also embed different entry points on different pages. So for example, a different chat experience begins on their research page, let's say, as opposed to their study and courses tab. So keep that in mind. But let's start interacting with the bot by clicking the messenger icon. You see that I've previously engaged with this bot. As long as you're signed into your Facebook account in the browser, it will automatically allow you to engage. If you're not though, you won't be able to interact. So that is an important distinction. If you have an audience that doesn't use Facebook, which you probably wouldn't be building a bot if that was the case anyway, but if you do have an audience that doesn't have Facebook accounts, they will not be able to engage with the bot. But anyway, in this case, you see I'm going through the basic onboarding here. I have different options as to how I want to engage with the bot, but that's probably not too, too exciting for you. So let's show you in Facebook how to actually set this up on your website. So I'm gonna to go to my business page settings here. And under the messenger platform, I'm going to scroll down to the customer chat plugin and click set up. So here I can get going. Right off the bat, I can choose the language that I wanna use. So if you're in a different country, you have a different audience, you can adjust that as needed. And then you can also specify and customize the greeting text that you wanna use. Here, I'll just use the default, but you can change that as needed. Then this is probably one of my favorite components of this setup. You can customize the coloring of the customer chat plugin to fit your specific brand colors. So you can either enter in a custom value here or choose from a number of preset colors here. So for example, if you wanna use a flare of green, you can do just that. Then it'll finally provide you, once you've selected all these options, the actual code to embed between the body tags of your website's HTML code. And you have two options. You can either install the code yourself by doing what I just described, pasting this between the body tags of your website, or you can also email directly instructions to your developers so they can handle that for you. Either way, it's a super simple setup, and I highly encourage you to try the customer chat plugin today and gain some more bot subscribers.